There's no rules to this. Just because the younger generation thinks that we should act a certain way or look a certain way, no. Do you? changes and so does our hair color um, but let's live our lives and not our ages I was never one to fit in a box society's norm of what uh, an older woman is supposed to be I've always lived outside the box, always. And I'm not gonna start now conforming to society's idea of what an older woman should be. So I have five tips for the older woman. I call them seasoned women. Five makeup tips that I live by. Number one, don't listen to anybody. One of the reasons I started this channel was because I couldn't relate to any of the older YouTubers uh, making videos on makeup. Nobody in my age group I could relate to. And if you look at the younger YouTubers videos on uh, how older women should do makeup, they try to push what they think is age appropriate. Now, I don't watch any of those younger YouTubers anymore that uh, try to push what they think uh, that an older woman should be wearing. I just don't watch them. I just don't. I came, uh, I came across this one, this poor woman. She must, she must have been in her 60s. And this young YouTuber... This young YouTuber uh, was using a foundation on her face. First of all, it was a full coverage. It was a shiny full coverage. It wasn't a matte. It was really shiny. And this poor woman, by the time he was done, I was laughing hysterically. 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 Because this... I felt so bad for her, too. This poor woman, she looked... She looked like this plastic doll uh, with this shiny, shiny face, and it was, oh, it was so bad. So I, I use um, a very low coverage foundation. I don't think older women should be, I don't, I don't think the seasoned woman should be using a full coverage. Um, I think our goal should be just to get rid of the redness and look as natural as possible. Uh, I just don't, I just, I don't get the younger YouTubers and their interpretation of what an older woman should be wearing on their face. I don't get it. My goal on this channel is to tell you what I use, what works for me, and if you try it and it works for you, then fantastic. But if you like to do things other ways, then have at it. It's your face. Do what you what makes you feel good.
please don't ever let anyone tell you what you're supposed to look like or how you're supposed to act. Number two, do your own thing. If it makes you feel good about yourself, then do it. If you want to tease your hair or uh, dye your hair a crazy color, or blonde. Hey, if you want to wear uh, the, uh, you want to wear the trendy clothes. You want to look wear clothes that your daughter wears. You want to wear clothes that your grandkids wear. Do it. wrong with sitting down and spending time with yourself and making yourself feel good making you making the uh, giving yourself confidence nothing wrong with that if you like uh, the smoky eyes like for instance the smoky eyes uh, you can watch YouTube videos they do not have to be geared to the uh, to the older woman Get on there and watch uh, how uh, they do the smoky eye and practice it. If that's something that you like, there's no reason why you can't uh, have a smoky eye. Perfect that look that you want. Something that you think is you. Because what I think is right for me may not be right for you. So just play around with it. And make it your own. Make it make it what how you feel inside or how you want to portray yourself to others. Just take the time for yourself. And that's where we get into number four, which is practicing. So our faces are changing every single day. Almost daily I'm noticing uh, changes in the way my face is. Um, shape and uh, you know new things are going this way and that way and uh, so I practice uh, trying to make everything look symmetrical I noticed that uh, this side of my face uh, my eye uh, it, this side is drooping a lot faster than this side um, may have something to do with um, my illness, but it's also probably just age and, um, 
So what I have to do is I have to use my um, my eyeliner and I have to make my eyes look symmetrical um, and overcompensating this side just slightly so that I look uh, so it looks good on both sides and it looks the same. And I do this by practicing and I practice day, like not every day, but I do I practice a lot and I practice um, as my face changes, so do the way I so does as my face changes, so does the way I put on my makeup. Uh, colors. There is absolutely no reason why you can't use bold colors. Like I said, you just do what do what you want. It there is no perfect. There is no uh, there's no rules to this. There shouldn't be anyways. Look the way you want to look. It's really that simple. Practice being you, not someone else. It's okay to copy a look, like if you like um, the way uh, you like the way a celebrity looks, the way they do their makeup, no matter what their age is. Go ahead and do it. never fit into society's box of what I'm supposed to be or who I'm supposed to be or how I'm supposed to act. Sometimes I'm a little crazy. Sometimes I'm outspoken. Sometimes uh Sometimes I'm loud. You know what? This is my life. I'm not going to stop because somebody tells me that uh, I should be doing things differently. I'm not. Oh, by the way, I'm using this coffee cap palette because I just love it. <laughs> putting my makeup like I'm going to a photo shoot today. <laughs> but you know what? That's okay and I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> I have to say there's also days where I just feel like <sighs> if 
There's also days where I just um, go into myself and stay quiet and think. Um, I I don't like wings on my eyes. I don't think that's something that my face uh, looks good with because my eyes are a little off. Hey, but if you like them, go for it. There's no reason, there's no reason why an older woman can't wear a wing. I will never ever be what society tells me is the norm. I never have. And I never will. So, in a nutshell, here. My tips, my advice. anyone. Do your own thing. Conform to the way society tells you you're supposed to look. Practice, practice, practice making time for yourself. That's it. Let your hair down and just be you. You will not comply with society. Today's video. If 
If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.